Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining me today and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, it's a late summer morning right before school starts and I want to share our routine with you. It's a slow morning for us, so I'm going to take a couple moments to just rub my eyes and have some water. Eventually I'll get up here and find my slippers and then I always turn off the baby monitors before I head downstairs. Now that I'm downstairs, both of my kids do still drink milk first thing in the morning, so I prepare a cup of milk for both of them, and then for myself, I prepare a little bit of apple juice mixed into my water. My blood sugar has been a little low lately, which makes me kind of jittery, so this just helps to balance out my blood sugar a little bit first thing in the morning. And this particular morning, my husband got James out of bed for me and gave him his morning hugs and kisses and then brought him out to me. So I'm going to change him real quick and get him started on his milk. And I always like to take a few minutes every morning to cuddle each one of the kids. So James is going to get his cuddles and Olivia will get her cuddles in a little bit. And then I like to read for a few minutes before I really get going. It just helps me relax. Before I get breakfast ready, I go around to each of the kids' rooms and I make sure to unplug their night lights and um, always put their little safety stoppers back in their outlets. Back in the kitchen, it's time to make breakfast and this morning I am keeping it kind of fresh. We're having some fresh fruit and I'm giving each of the kids a big spoonful of peanut butter because they just love it and it gives them some protein to get the day going and Olivia also had requested if she could have a yogurt with her breakfast so she's going to have a yogurt and since both of the kids are still pretty little I do like to cut their fruit up for them, so I'll slice up some strawberries and then I'll cut their bananas up nice and little and just give them easy pieces to pick up. I find they're more likely to eat more um, if they're not trying to wrap themselves around a big huge piece of fruit. And then once that's done, it's time for me to have some breakfast. And so I am going to start out with a fresh cup of coffee. And I just add a splash of milk and a tiny little bit of syrup. And then I made some toast. 
and I'm going to slice up this banana here to top my peanut butter toast with and I'm going to use some strawberry too. Usually at some point during breakfast, I end up getting out a clean washcloth and wiping off the baby and starting to get him cleaned up. As you can see, he's almost done eating. He has his feet up on the table and <laughs> then I, once they're all done, I let them go play and they've been having fun on the couch lately. And then I'll do a quick cleanup of the kitchen before I get myself ready for the day. All right, so once I get all that done, it's time for me to head upstairs and straighten up a little bit. And really all I like to do is just make my bed look nice again and replace the blankets a little bit. It doesn't have to be perfect. And then I'm just going to pick out what accessories I want to have on that day and grab my clean clothes. And then I'll head back downstairs to get myself cleaned up for the day. I'm gonna finish my hair and then I'll get you all cleaned up, okay? Most mornings I do let the kids just run around and play with a cartoon on in the background and this does give me time to get cleaned up and get ready for the day. Uh, this particular morning I did shampoo and blow dry my hair. I don't do that every morning, however, this is sort of a luxury that I get uh, about two times a week. And I find that that's just fine for my hair to not wash it every day. I find that it keeps it a lot healthier, so I don't mind at all. And today's makeup is super easy too. Today's makeup is just a little bit of BB cream, a tiny bit of mascara, and some lip gloss. And I'll be all done because I don't want to take too much time since I already shampooed my hair. But I did have a few extra minutes after I was done, so I sat down and went through a couple of emails really quick while the kids finished up a cartoon. And by then, they were starting to get bored, so I decided it was some a good time to 
go outside to play. I'm just gonna grab a quick cup of coffee before we go outside. <laughs> So outside time usually consists of a few different things. You can see the kids have a lot to play with and it gives me a couple more minutes to read and then play with the kids. Eventually, I do get back up again and start cleaning up the yard a little bit. You can see the chickens left me messes, and there, this day there was like this giant weed growing by my lilac bush, and I just had to clean it up. It was such an eyesore after a while, so I trimmed that all down. And now it's time to give my chickens some breakfast. They've been in their house all night, so they are really, really excited to get up and play. Are you excited? Ah, oh, it's breakfast time! And lately I've been letting the kids splash around in some water. Um, we usually just make a muddy puddle in the backyard and they get to play and just get messy and they have a lot of fun with it. And then while I have the water out, it's actually the perfect time for me to water all my plants and make sure the garden is doing well. And we don't do this every day either, but we were running low on milk and some fruit. So I made a quick little stop down to the market and just got a few ingredients for some things that we needed. Cold in there. Then once we get home, it's time for me to have lunch. So I'm making a giant green smoothie. And if you want the recipe for this, I'll put it below. It makes enough for me to have a few servings throughout the week. And then I'm just gonna have my lunch and get the kids ready for a nap and our morning will actually be over. So thank you for joining me today. And I hope you guys like this video. Uh, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks guys. Bye.